for tuning into my channel. Today is similar to many of the videos that I create. I am creating something and I was cleaning out my office and I spotted two brand new tees that I knew I bought to um, monogram or just some type of craft with the kids and I eyeballed some scrap fabric and I knew exactly what I wanted to do with it. I wanted to try my hand at creating a pocket tee and I did that. It may not be the perfect um, attempt because this was my first time and when I did it I said let me turn on the camera and just walk through what I did for you. So if you are interested please stay tuned. I love how it turned out. Let me tell you the supplies that I used. Of course, a t-shirt, scrap fabric, or you can go out and buy something fun if you don't have it on hand, but I just used something that I already had. Pins and clips. Fusible interfacing, and this is going to go on the back of the fabric pocket. Scissors, and I like to use a rotary cutter, but if you don't have that, scissors will work just fine. A ruler. And some heat and bond tape. And if you don't want to sew this project, you can definitely use this to adhere your pocket to your tee. A marker and cardstock or paper so that you can trace out your pocket template. I used a cutting mat, but this is also optional. An iron to iron down your folds and creases and to secure your heat and bond tape and you can use a sewing machine or a needle and thread to complete the project and let's get started you can download the pocket templates on um, Google you can do a simple search or you can find a pocket that you already have in your home and just trace that out and once you get your template, the template is going to be much larger than the actual pocket because as you can see here, there's some excess around the pocket once I've folded it and I use that as a guide to fold the back of the pocket and I'm going to show you that in just a moment. But your template will be a lot larger than the actual pocket and with the excess, I folded over a half inch of the fabric and I secured it with the heat and bond and it's just iron on um, tape that you know just saves a lot of time and you can stop right here don't even have to take this to a sewing machine you can use some more heat bond tape and just iron it on to your tee. I want to secure this by using the sewing machine I want to see how it'll look with the stitches outside of the pocket and you can also do this um, by hand sewing it but I'm just going to try it with my sewing machine so I want to find an ideal spot to put the pocket on the t-shirt and I have my ruler here to um, you know once I get a spot that I'm I'm liking I am going to see how um, how many inches from the neck and the arm I need to place the pocket for you know future projects and you know this will just be an easy guide for me. Mm -hmm. 
and I want to say that I added the fusible interfacing to the fabric just to give it a little bit more structure. Um, the fabric alone is okay, but the pocket tends to, um, it can get floppy and with the interfacing, it just makes it keep shape and that's what I wanted. I'm going to take this to the sewing machine and give it about a quarter of an inch stitch all the way around the pocket, leaving the top of it open so that it can actually be a pocket. Now, will I use this to put things in? No, but I do want it to still have the feel of a pocket. I really like how this turned out. I'm so um, proud of myself for, you know, not prolonging this and just giving it a shot. And now I'm thinking about um, adding a monogram to this pocket. Is that doing too much? Should I keep it as is or should I add something to the front of it? Let me know down in the comment area what you think I should do to it. And I want to also ask you to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you have not. I'd love for you to stick around and um, create with me. I am super excited to do more of these pocket tees. And I want to also know in the comment area if this is something that you think that you would try. Friends, until next time, have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.